for your health tonight. It starts in the field, it moves to the grocery store, and then to your fridge. An E. coli outbreak linked to romaine lettuce is not over yet. It has left five people in Washington and 10 in Idaho sick. KXY 4's Taylor Graham working for you tonight. She spoke with several local grocers and shoppers today to find out how to make sure to avoid this outbreak. Taylor? Nadine, one produce manager says even though their romaine was grown in California, not Yuma, Arizona, where the source of this E. coli outbreak has been identified, the store pulled all of its lettuce from shelves last night because of concern from shoppers. But you should know, even if you do see romaine on shelves in your produce department, it doesn't mean there's cause for concern. A typically simple task just got a little more complicated. Thanks so much. Oh God, it's scary because you don't know, am I going to be one of those numbers that they're talking about? When Christine Ash heads to the grocery store, her hardest decision may be white or wheat bread. Now, a simple choice could have major effects on her health. It's whether or not to buy romaine lettuce. Some of the people will just uh, avoid it all. Jack Green owns Green's Fresh Market. He's seen customers stay away from romaine due to a recent E. coli outbreak, which has sickened nearly 100 across the country. When he heard the news, he thought his livelihood was in jeopardy. Panic, uh, you know, lost sales, people fearing all of a sudden, you know, that other things are going to be affected. Green says the infected lettuce was grown in Yuma, Arizona. If it was grown anywhere else, he says you're in the clear. Green gets his romaine from Salinas, California, so he hasn't run into any problems yet, just questions. His answer? Be proactive, wash your vegetables well, and ask where they're coming from. Now, Ash knows her trips to the store come with an added responsibility. We're ultimately responsible for the safety of our food that we choose to eat. Going forward, the, the Center for Disease Control and Perfect... The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says if you don't know where the romaine you're buying is from, don't eat it. Reporting live from Spokane, Taylor Graham, KXOY4 News. Thank you, Taylor.